Here goes the moon landing. Hooray! I get huge science and culture bonus effectively, which is nice. Synthetic materials. Cold War. Does Cold War do anything for me? Oh, well, that's quite good. Yeah, look, look, look. Here we go. Um, cryptography. Oh, I can do that instead of Rogue State just for now. Awesome, right. Basically, spies are useless. It's useless in my territory. Ah, uh, and I've got a great person. Like, like I'm, I'm not in a dark age for the first time. Brilliant. If I can get 11 more points in, well, 12 to 22 turns, I mean, that'd be great. I'll be, I'll be swimming. I'll be, I can be actually happy for once, which would be really nice. Look at all these buildings I can get. All of these cool buildings that I want to get, but I can't because I need to build Mars reactors and things. Uh, well, it is what it is. Screw civil prestige and going rogue state again because I think we're one turn away from the Manhattan Project. Oh yeah, we're definitely going to become a rogue state. That sound that suits me to the ground. I love that. We've got the Manhattan Project, and I was just about to complain about my spies because another one got away. No idea how, but we did actually. We also captured a Kemmer spy who was disrupting rocketry. I mean, you're supposed to be my ally, but never mind. Never mind. It, all the operations are, unfortunately, ones that attack rather than defend. But oh well, neutralize governor. Maybe if I give him that, he'll be better at stopping it. <laughs> he hopefully wishes. Um, hey, things are going good. I'm just sort of chilling at the moment. There's very little for me to do. I'm going to build an art museum so that I've got somewhere to put my great artists. I'm basically just waiting until my projects are built. I've got a governor coming in. Yeah, there's not much going on, unfortunately. Oh, I can build a ferris wheel though. I mean, that's cool. Here I am foolishly building things in my cities that aren't atomic bombs. Why? Why would I even do that? I mean, I could get Operation Ivy. Oh, that's a fun one. Let's get Operation Ivy, yeah. Yeah, that'll be, that'll be fine. This city can just build a regular nuke, but Operation Ivy, in the meantime, that'll help. That'll, that'll help our plight. Mars. We've got all the projects now to, to actually build the damn things. I can't bother to do any of this now. Future tech. Oh, apparently I don't need to research any of the future tech ones. Well, um, that's a bit of a, a bit lackluster. Military tactics. Oh my goodness, I didn't realize we hadn't had that. Terrible. Terrible indeed. Right, well, we'll get all these and then we'll get future tech. There we go. How about that? Make us seem like we're actually playing this game properly, which we definitely, definitely are. Oh, Hattusa has been lost as well. Oh my god, England are really under the ropes here. Although England have just switched to a democracy, which is cool. I think Rome are a democracy, the Kima are a democracy, 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 democracy. We're all democracies, everyone. No one's gone fascism. What a wonderful world we live in, eh? Oh, Trajan, he's put a satellite into space. My ally is being dragged along with me, although I'm the only person to have actually done most of these things. So I'm not, I'm not worried too much. Art museum, all of, you know, all of these things are good. All of these things are good, but nuclear devices. I just want everyone to build a nuclear device now. Quick, Mr. Artist, go and make something about a nuclear device. It's not quite, not quite what I envisioned, but you know, it's fine. It's fine. And there goes the Mars reactor. It's number one. Hooray! Geneva's back, also. That's quite cool. I mean, I don't need it anymore. And if anything, it's just giving science to my, you know, competitors. But cool. Whatever. It's all fine. Again, all of this stuff I want to build, it's all so good. But I can't. I've got to build this. I mean, outgoing trade routes, incoming trade routes. It's a lot of, a lot of production for me, actually. A lot of people are trading with me. Cool. Well, 10 turns, apparently. Globalization. No, oh, it's so lovely. I could, I could use this to actually give myself a ton of extra money. New Deal is amazing. I don't need any of these these, these science boosts anymore. Actually, now that I think about it, because quite honestly, I've got as much as I need. E-commerce. Oh my goodness, this is huge. It's like ex five extra production, ten extra gold from each trade route. That's that's amazing. Okay, yeah, that's fine. That's good. Uh, anything else that I could use? I just need extra production from anything really doesn't really matter what it is um the robber barons i mean this one over here but that takes off loads of immunities so i kind of don't want to do that if i can help it um any any ideas 
throw some ideas at me? I'm sure. I'm sure they're all good ideas. Except from that one. Ugh, that's a terrible idea. Industrial zone adjacency bonuses, let's just do that. Let's just do that for now. I'm sure that'll be fine. The problem I've got at the moment is every turn the camera keep trying to trade their spy back for me. And every time I say no, they just keep sort of going, all right, fine, wait like a single turn and then immediately trade again going, uh, but have you reconsidered? Uh, I'd really want to trade that with you again. And you just kind of go, no, like stop, go away. Like I, I told you no once. Absolutely ridiculous. I don't even know why they keep trading with me. It's just a nightmare. My population of my capital is now almost 23. It's pretty cool. My space project is about to release its second, uh, well, release into the sky. I, I very much don't know otherwise how to put that. Um, but yeah, yeah, it's cool. We're doing all right. Doing all right. Oh, also, um, other news. I'm building an encampment because I realised I haven't got anywhere that I can uh, launch a nuke from. Which is a bit, of a, a bit of a shame. There we go. Look, I told you. New spacecraft. Woo! Into the air it goes. Oh, cool. Look at this. Mars hydroponics, four turns. Jeez, that's quick. That's a, that's a quick build, that. Spaceport. You're too slow. In the time it took you to build a spaceport, this, this, my capital has sent four things into space. Um, you know. Poor effort. Poor effort all round there. Nuclear device completed. Those are those are magic words to me. Let's build a thermonuclear device now. I feel like we should stretch ourselves a little bit. The game looks really bright when you go into a normal era after being so depressed for so long. That's, that's a shame. I kind of we were so close to getting a gold era there, but never mind. Never mind. Um, cool. Right. Well, let's just uh, sky and stars again. That always seems to be a good good one there. Uh, apparently. I, I'm in this era for the rest of the game. So that's a sad one that I missed out there. I want a bomber. Apparently a bomber I can I can launch a, a nuke with. We'll, we'll see about that. Oh man, I can't be a rogue nation anymore because I'm not on a poor era. That's a shame. That's a shame. I kind of enjoyed that. My, 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 rogue, my rogue state sort of play there. Never mind. Oh look, I have a jet bomber. And I'm one turn away from winning the game. Persia, you have all game been my absolute best friend. Why don't I, why don't I return the favour? Um, hmm, do I do this? Uh, yes. Da 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 da, da 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 da, da 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 da. <laughs> the satisfaction. Oh, it's beautiful. It's beautiful to watch. It succeeded. That's I, I, I do get the idea that you could, in theory, not succeed with an attack like that, but um, that was worth it. Just for that. I may just get nuked to destruction back now, but um, it was worth it, you know? It was worth it. And with this, I'm hoping, uh, short of a... Short of a sort of retaliation from my allies or from, from Persia, which which may happen, to be fair. Rome seems to have, uh, well, seems to be thinking about what they're doing with me. I'm hoping this is going to be the last turn and that we're going to finally send this thing to space. Oh look, all these anti-tank crews are coming in. Well, I mean, you can try. You can try, I guess, but, you know, it's a bit too late now. Ah, oh, this was a fun game, and by that I mean I hate Deity. I really, really do hate Deity. It's just so, like, cheaty, and you can't really do anything. You're kind of forced into a corner, and you have to kind of turtle up, and, like, I know it, people make, you know, people will say, it makes you play better, you know? It makes you think about the game and, and forward plan and, and use all the strategies of the game to sort of make yourself win, but I, I like Emperor. I like Immortal, you know those difficulties where you can actually do stuff as you want to. But we still won. Deity difficulty, we still won. Let that be a lesson to everybody who thinks that Ursa Ryan can't actually play Civ and that he larks about all the time. Because I can. I promise I can. Ah, oh, and there we go. Thanks, Sean. I, 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 I'm not actually going to watch that. You might have seen I did get the achievement because I've never actually bothered to do a science victory before because they are the most boring of all of them. But there we go. Science victory for you. What is, uh, what's the ranking I got? 16. That's not very good. I kind of hoped I'd get a bit more than that. What, uh, 
Right, let's just go to one more turn. Take a look at this. We're 1880 science victory turn 156. I mean, it's not it's not up there with the best deity players, but uh, that's pretty good. Career are pretty cool, weren't they? I mean, you really do turtle up extra extra defensive units, extra food, extra science, a ton of extra like science sort of generally speaking. I mean, I had 400 science at one point. It's absolutely mad. I mean, just brilliant, fantastic, but, uh, but a bit, a bit cheaty, but um, <laughs> you know, it was still fun, nonetheless. I'm really tempted to drop a second on here again. That's, uh, that's my jet bomber. Here we go, let's just drop a, drop a second bomb, shall we? Uh, let's see if this one works. Might get shot down. I don't think Persia have got any planes, but we'll see. Anyway, just to, just to wind them up. Here we go, it was successful. Oh, I love the nuclear bomb animation. It is by far the best animation in any Civ so far, in my opinion. But um, that is just my humble opinion. Thank you so much for watching, guys. I really do appreciate it. And to all those people that have liked and subscribed so far, thank you very much. I'm, I'm planning on taking a little bit of a break from sort of regular Civ playthroughs, do a couple more guides, a couple more sort of comedy games, other games like that. But please, if you want me to do anything, leave me a comment, leave me a like, let me know and I'll see what I can do. But until then, thank you so much for watching and I shall see you next time. Bye!